in the name of science, since I had a, a user just ask me what would happen if I were to accidentally pull the hard drive out of my bay here while it's playing or while it's being accessed. Okay, well let's see what happens. Okay, you can see the drive is, uh, is working there. Let's uh, eject it and see what happens. Oh. File failed to read. Interesting. Okay, take the drive out. Okay, let's put it back in and see what happens. And close that down. And uh, we'll just open the file, open it up again here, and see what happens. Do I want to scan and fix the drive? Yeah, I'll scan it. No problems were found with your drive. Open it up. There you go. Okay, let's uh, plug the same drive into my uh, TV and see what happens on that. So, we'll stop it. And again, um, I always go down and do a safe removal just because that's me. I do a safe removal before I, I remove it. But you don't have to. I'll put my other drive back in that I use on my computer. We'll move over and place this drive into my smart TV and we'll eject it on there and watch what happens. Nothing will happen. Okay, there's a smart TV running. We'll drop the drive in. Turn it on. And it'll read the drive automatically. That's just a, a background player that plays that actual video. In standard definition that's not what's coming off this drive it just happens to be what is on that particular channel that I can show you right I can put that one on too because there's nothing on there um, let's go to my source I go over to my hard drive here okay there's the hard drive we'll play the fireplace Okay, fireplace is playing, and I'll just, uh, you know, not even bother to turn it off, just, just pull the drive out. Okay, stop playing. Put the drive back in. You notice I did it without even turning off the power. It'll read the drive, and I should be able to go back over here. Okay, yeah, I like to browse my files. Thank you very much. Browse my files. and start it playing. There you go. There's your answer. No, it won't hurt it. It's hot swappable. Okay, so we know that nothing happens to the drive if I'm reading from it, but what happens if I'm writing to the drive and we pull the drive out while it's writing? So, I'm going to uh, copy a file. Let's see if I can find something here that I can copy over here. Um, just, I'll download a movie. What the heck, eh? copy a movie over. I'll just say I'll drag. I'll drag something over here. Okay, I'm copying this movie and it's a four and a half gigabyte title because it's a big one. And I'll let this thing be copying here for a bit and then I'll just eject the drive. And we'll see what happens because now I'm going to create a write error. So, oh boy, I just uh, caused a problem there, didn't I? I can't do this. If I put the drive back in, what's going to happen now when I put the drive back in while well, it's copying? And it's going to probably fail. And if I open the drive up again here, drive is booting up. It probably ask me if I want to check it for errors because I just ejected the drive, something you should never ever ever do by the way. Uh, scan and fix for sure. And it says there's no problems found on the drive and it's ready to use. But uh, that file that I was going to copy, nothing happened to it, it didn't copy, but it didn't damage the other files that are there. I can still load them up and play them. There's fireplace video, here's my rain video and it's all there 
and here's my Storm and Tofino and here's my Oregon Coast these are the 4k videos so that answers your question nothing absolutely nothing happens to it it's hot swappable the only thing I lost was I lost the file that I was trying to write to it which was expected 